I'm Dave Vizzola. I'm about 5'10 and about 175. Uh, junior at Coral Springs Charter. 5'10, 175. Now, when most people say, you know, quarterback, you're not thinking a 5'10 quarterback is going to come in and play. But due to the performance that we saw tonight, what do you have to say to those haters out there that, that are all over six foot at quarterback? That size does not matter. We're, we're in here, the game, we broadcast the game tonight. You came out on top. It's a great win. Obviously, it's homecoming, so we can expect certain things with a homecoming game. You had a tough loss last week. Uh, you came up short. What are some of the thoughts from last week's game? Last week, we just had mental mistakes. If we just had two or three more plays, we would have won. We lost by one. Really tough, but we came back in one. Should have had a shutout, but we won the homecoming for the seniors. Now, expectations coming into this season. As you said, you're a junior, correct? As a junior, what are some of expectations that you had coming into this season, and have you fulfilled those things by this point? Uh, our goal was to go undefeated, but we lost two. But that's fine because all of our expectations are still in front of us. I believe we're going to go to FAU and win the championship. There you go. Now, coming off this win tonight, what are some of the things that you can take from this game and translate coming going into the playoffs? Uh, we all just did our job, so if we just continue to do that, we should be fine. Everyone executed every play correctly, and we came out 52 to 8. Now, I want to talk about, I had a chance to talk to the general manager, and I talked about what what it's like to be able to have a community that supports you. Uh, being that we're a product of Coral Springs, Coral Springs Charter, what is it like to have that support from the community, such as an alehouse type restaurant? You can come out, hang out with your friends. It's awesome. We really look forward to coming out, winning, and then coming here to with all of our fans and friends and family after the win. And Coral Springs in general, you know, the support to be able to see uh, what's it like not only to be coached by former uh, Panther players, but have a crowd like that tonight. Does it really inspire you? Yeah, I really like how all of our coaches played for Charter because they understand what we're going through. They sat in the same seats as we did, and I don't know, the atmosphere was really good. Now, individually, what are some of the things that you want to work on for the rest of the season? My throwing, get more accurate, stay in the pocket, don't roll out every time, never across your body. Yeah. Well, I thank you for joining me once again. This is Ryan Stout alongside the starting quarterback, a main man over here at Coral Springs, in Coral Springs, at the Coral Springs Ale House. Once again, first time ever we're able to come in live and broadcast the game, rebroadcast the game, which is pretty awesome. So, ladies and gentlemen, tune in next week. Make sure you follow Coral Springs Charter the rest of this season.